No one can do it better. No one can do it better. Alright, alright, welcome back to the world is ghetto ENT. Today I got another reaction today, but before we hop into that, real quick, I just want to give a special shout out to all the real ones that have been in my comment section giving me love. You know, I support you guys back. You support me. I support all the real ones. You know, uh, keep on showing me love. I know my mic don't sound the best. I know I don't have the best equipment right now, but I'm trying my best to, you know, figure this out. You know, little by little. You know, just bear with me. And, you know, uh, thank you to all the real ones supporting me. Salute to them. Now let's get back into the reaction. You know, today I'm reacting to Milk74 on if Crit Max should get his forehead tat move and thoughts on X4. I just want to get my thoughts on Milk74 right now. It's funny how he talks shit about Adam22, calls him like Adam16, say you'll never be on his podcast again. He calls him all these words and shit, but he's on his podcast. He says he will never be on his podcast, but he's on his podcast. You know, that's just a hypocrite sellout, you know. Don't fuck with him. I don't fuck with him for saying that and then going back on his word. No, I don't fuck with him. You know, this is probably a sign that his channel's dying, you know. I don't know. Other than that, I'm going to get into this reaction video. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment down below. Helps if you guys will hit that thumbs up. Extra support. And uh, let's get into it. Ooh, so speak on that real quick. Yeah. So there was a theory uh -huh. that Adam and Wack <laughs> yeah. uh, I forgot about that, yeah. That was a crazy situation. to buy you fake followers. That was wild. Uh, so one... So one, I guess you're here now. Right. And you can answer to to like that theory. I have never bought anybody fake followers. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. Uh, okay. I never said he did it. Uh, Even okay. when they said it, I said, nah, why would he do it? And he's like in the same lane. Like yeah. who wants that type of energy? Like that's kind of like, <laughs> yeah. that's horrible to deal with. I feel like there's certain things yeah. I won't do. Like I won't make a burner account to like comment and yeah, shit like that. Yeah, that's wild. Because like people always that's accuse cat. me of that. And I'm like, I'm not going to cross that line. Even if that is something nah, that would I be kind of like, fun. Mm -hmm. But and then also like, like I'm not going to like. I feel like somewhere Adam Twenty Two got a burner account and he be like texting and trolling and shit. They, they, they gotta be capped. Get somebody's Instagram like, deleted. I'm not gonna buy somebody <laughs> fake followers or some shit like that. that, oh, wow. that that's, <laughs> no, I, got, I feel I got, like that shit's like over the line. Yeah. I got my ideas like who it was. Whoa, come on! It, I'm not gonna say who it was. Okay. It was a. It was. It was. But it was like it. It had something to do with. Crit Mac. It didn't have nothing to do with him, but the people around him. Oh, so it was an old, dirty man, though. slim individual. Mm. Oh, oh, they're slim. Yeah, and somebody okay. he was dealing with because a lot of the bot comments that was coming. Yeah. Uh, apologize to Crip Mac. Uh, <laughs> leave Crip Mac alone. Yeah. Uh, apologize. That's all it was saying, bro. But why? Buy, was it just to like discredit you? Like probably, but that shit yeah. ain't gonna work. Why do I need to buy views? Fact. And then I earn an income off this shit. Fact. Yeah. So doing mm. that, YouTube is able to tell clearly not enough income. Cause here you are on Adam Twenty Two's podcast while you were talking shit about him like a couple months ago, which is it's kind of crazy, you know. Caught him all these sh all this shit. Say you never get on this podcast. Caught him the P E D O. Adam 16, yada, 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 this, that, this, that, and you're on this podcast again. Sell up, my boy. You, you sell up. I don't know how people still fuck with you after this. Where, who's buying them, how, where, like off of your IP or whatever. Yeah, I ain't never did no shit like that in my life. But that's not, Cap. yeah, but nah. If I would, why Cap. every video wouldn't, if I was able to do that realistically, like yeah. people would be rich then because they could just buy as many views as they want and run it up. But I've had people buy fake views on my videos like oh, yeah, for themselves. And it's like, feel. you don't make money off the fake views. No, I'm you pretty don't. sure. Yeah. yeah and yeah. they go like, like the subscribers that they bought, at first, I didn't know because they was going like I told you when everybody's making the videos, the subscribers was going up. So when they went up at first, I'm like, OK. And then like I think some Crip Mac has just did a video on me on a n interview or something. Mm. But then it, it started going too fast and yeah. then it went down. So that's how I knew yeah. some was fishy. That shit weird, bro. I, I, whoever did that, yeah. that's why they ain't do doing shit now. Now, Odium Slim did say that he pulled up on you. Uh, Look, that yeah, dude, video. Nah, but it is weird. People buying fake views and shit like that, fake subscribers. That shit ain't gonna. That shit gonna get you so far until, until you get caught or until like, yeah, until you get caught. You know, people be having like a hundred thousand subscribers, and they be having like two hundred people in their in their chat. Like, what the fuck? You supposed to have like thousands. 
Those are that shorts, goofy yeah. pulled up in a parking garage. <laughs> That's what you call Gilligan activity. <laughs> he didn't go in the lobby. But you put up to <laughs> what garage did you pull up to? And how yeah. do you know what garage to pull up to? And how do you know what floors, multiple floors? So you pull up to a bottom of the garage and yell, milk, mm-hmm. milk. That's like a weird old J-Cat mission. Yeah. That's like me seeing you in the county jail and it's the sheriff's or something right there. And then I just start going up on you. Right. Yeah, you record like a video. Yeah, and if you really like, want to do something, window. like if you really trying to do something yeah. you should, and you know where I live, why are you not catching me? Mm. Yeah. Because you realistically, you going somewhere that you really can't prove that I was at. Yeah. In your head, I mean, you have not seen a picture of me in the parking garage that you could prove like... Or whatever, but you put up to the bottom of a parking garage and yelled milk. Yeah. Milk. <laughs> nah, that's okay. crazy. Yo, so you were the first person where I seen hood niggas doing like trigonometry, right? Yo, they were like judging like the angles of the shapes in the background. <laughs> and that's how they could like determine like where milk lives, right? For me, right? But like, how they know that ain't a background? I mean, a, a green screen. Well, you was on like the balcony, like right, like yeah, oh, that's, that's true. Screen. Yeah, that's true, right? Yeah, right. In my head, I call it the balcony. The balcony. Yeah. It, 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 it is famous for the balcony. The yeah, they yeah. call me the balcony. Uh, the balcony kanga. I'm like, get I'm, off that balcony. I'm not, but the balcony. I'm on here running shit up and, and C Mac getting used and abused and getting contracts on his name and. Yo, speak on that, bro. Yeah. But he was just, dude, on Drewski's reality show. I watched yeah, it. No, and- I feel like. Ever since Crit Mag got caught up for whatever he did, I ain't gonna speak on that. But ever since he got caught up, I feel like he's been forgotten, you know? Not not too many people are still, you know, talking to him or keeping it day one with him. You know, I, I don't even know if China Mac is still, is still visiting him, because I know he was gonna have some shit with him, you know? I know he's gonna help him fight it and shit like that. But I don't, I don't even know if he's with him. It's crazy how people get forgotten real quick. Once you go to jail, you just get forgotten. And he, t- he took a, sh- a sneak shot at Munchie B, Andy Diz the Hoovers on this fucking huge reality show that's going to get like six million views. I've seen a clip of it where he was with the dude that you had on here. Yeah, with Tony Wilrus. They yeah, brought him and back. He was yeah. like, the Hoovers ain't even going to want you. <laughs> it's super funny they brought him back together. <laughs> that, yeah, right. that was wild. Because I think yeah. they might got, you know, they well, might got something going on. Do you feel like Crip Mac will still be able to maintain his relevance when he gets out of jail in like what? Hopefully he beats it. It's probably going to be like three to five years. Oh, it's going to be more than that. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. Right? Yeah, like this ain't state. Right? This, this mm. ain't state. Yeah. He got priors. You feel me? Like, he, this ain't his first. That's why they picked it up. Mm. Because he kept really escaping the state. Right. Get out. Get probation. Get right, booked right again. Mm. Steve, keep want to wear khakis and, and, and pro club shorts. Get booked again. Yeah. You going to wear pro club shirts and have a big ass revolver in your pocket. It's something? crazy because when... Uh, when the Channel 5 shit, they did the fundraiser for him and they raised like 50 grand for him yeah. because basically like their legal defense idea, what Andrew talks about in that video, is that he's going to convince the judge that this is a mental health case and not like a crazy street gang member case. And I'm just like, I don't know, bro. Like you take one look at Crip Mag. Isn't that what every judge pictures in yep. their head when they picture like a gang member type case right like yeah. i don't know if the judge is going for the mental health exemption i'm gonna be honest with you though they came up with 55 um thousand so if they get the right lawyer yeah they might can you know Could but be. then he gonna come out you what, know thousand he gonna come <laughs> what a coincidence Fifty five thousand. <laughs> come out uh, uh yeah they i seen it they came up like when oh, i seen it, it was like forty nine thousand. yeah Oh, really? Yeah. Wait, and China Mac started that GoFundMe, right? No. no Andrew this from is, Channel 5. This, yeah, that Channel 5 shit. I really? Seen it. Shit, Yo, I didn't even know about that. He's real compassionate to like... To like to but the only thing stopping Crip Mac, though, is all the videos. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's so you ain't mental. As soon as he gets out, what's he going to do? He's going to get back on YouTube and start dissing everybody yeah. again. Yeah, right? but that's <laughs> his thing, and people going to watch it. Yeah. They going to watch he it. Yeah, like, people are still going to watch it. Like, uh, schizophrenic, that's right? Facts. Yeah, but... I don't know, bro, but you ain't that schizophrenic. And, and if the judge gave him some crazy ass exemption, don't you think they're also going to say, like, you're not allowed to publicly do gangbanging shit? They might say the tattoo's got to get removed. That's what they might say. It's hard to imagine him actually doing that. Well, it's either that, you, you know, will yeah. get, get 46 months in pro- parole if you remove that. Other than that, we about to go to trial and you about to get 
10 or, or 15, 15 years because he got priors he got he got out right when he got famous right yeah. gun charge right right again gun charge another i knew he had a gun charge before people even knew i just didn't say nothing another gun charge <laughs> Come on, G. Like, I, I remember him hosting the BMX jam and taking photos with, with all these the, little kids the and shit. You could see it you know in his head. You dressing like a gillian. <laughs> and he's DMing the kids trying to get them to delete it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> The word? kids are so happy they got a photo with him and he's hitting them up being like, delete that shit. Nah, you can't now, though, because you, you you remember you missed the destruction. You can't be worried about mm. that. It's too late. You That's why you got to start dressing better. But that's his image, though. But yeah, um, he went outside. In my eyes, I won the smarter. war in the battle with me and him. Oh, okay, so why do you feel like it was a war or battle? And well, I'm when, just saying that's what people said in the, mm, the YouTube shit. So. Facts. And when did y'all beef start then? It really wasn't a beef because I wasn't really sending up. I wasn't out there trying to really go to look to, on 55th and look for him. Yeah. But it was it was me because you know I just wanted to prove that maybe it got you know he ain't like that because a person his age. I don't think milk is going anywhere to look for anyone. From what I know, they're not gonna be on the Instagram really doing all that. Yeah. Yeah, doing what he's doing. And he's internet gang banging. Like he's dissing the hoods and that's kind of looked down upon mm -hmm. in South Central. Do you feel the same way about X4? Yeah, low key, yeah. You hating on his movement? No, I'm not hating on him. He could <laughs> he could blow up, you feel me? I'm I I if he make it in rap and, and don't yeah. have to do whatever you supposed you have to do in the streets, then that's cool. But mm -hmm. but once you blow up, kind of do what Nipsey did. And, you know, sweet. All right, this is where I'm going to end it. Because I don't know who X4 is. No, uh, no disrespect. I just don't know who he is. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment down below. Salute to all the real ones that's keeping it real on me. And it's always, uh, you know, show me love. You know, make sure you guys put a thumbs up on this video. And it'll help me a lot. And, uh, yeah, I'm trying to get this, this started. So just bear with me real quick. And uh, other than that, I already got nothing else to say. I'm out.